Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, Sumi Learns Chinese. 大家好，欢迎来到我的频道 Sumi 学中文。Today we are going to learn more vocabulary from New HSK Band One. Today is episode nine. 大家好，今天我们将会学习更多有关新 HSK 第一等级的字词。今天是第九集 ，The Last。Check it out. Today we are going to learn more vocabulary from New HSK One for the beginners. Today is episode nine. Okay, before、I、have a deep idea about what Chinese character we are going to use and we can apply in the daily life. First of all, we have to get the brief idea about what characters we're going to learn today. So today. We're gonna learn five phrases, which is started from s、嗯、and d, which is sounds like English letter c and d. Okay, the first one is 红红 which is 平舌音 That means your tongue and your lips should be s s s s 红红 Okay, the second one is s s 错，错 ，OK， 错，所以是红，错。Next one is 大，的，的啊，大，大 ，OK。Big。Number four is 大学 ，University，University University.。Number five， 大学生，大学生。Which is the university student? Okay, university student. Let's read all these phrases together from the episode nine. Okay, the first one, 从从 There was for from from number two, 错错 Which is incorrect or wrong. Number three, 大大 Big big. Number four, 大学大学 university, university. Number five, 大学生大学生 university student, university student. Okay, now let's learn the usage of each character. The first one is 从从 How do we write 从从 It's very easy. It seems like there are two people standing together. Okay. 人 another 人 so it is 从从 okay let's write it one more time 一二三四从 okay that means two people are walking together are to be、uh, to be together 这是两个人 two people so let's write it one more time 一二三四从从 okay from. So are you ready to get your pencil, your finger, your pen to write the Chinese on the paper or in the air with Sumi? So don't hesitate to write more. Okay, every lesson is very very important to write to practice the Chinese you have learned from the lesson. Okay, so don't be lazy. Don't be lazy. Okay, let's write it together. Okay. 从 So what is the usage of 从 It is from. I just came here from library. I just came here from library. 我我 That means I. I. 刚刚 That means just. You just few seconds、uh, ago. Okay, just. 从 From. From. 图书馆 Library. 图书馆 Library. 过来，过来 that means come, come. Okay, so let's read this whole sentence together with a slower mode. Okay, so it should be. 我刚从图书馆过来。我刚从图书馆过来。Okay, I just came here from library. 我刚从图书馆过来。Okay, next one. 错 Wrong, 错错怎么写呢 How do you write 错 It looks quite 
difficult actually because so many strokes. But you have to remember the pattern or the writing system is we have to write the Chinese from the left to right, from top to the bottom. So in this case, you should be written like this. One, two, one, two, and then like take. Remember the first one, we should not connect with the second one. So you just make a, you just think like it is like a hat and it's number two. And then I have to connect number two with an inverted go a take. Okay. Cool. Another one is one, two, three. Longer. And then a sun down below. Cool. Cool. Okay, so let's write it one more time. It is one, two, three, four. Okay, and then number two and number three connected with a take. Number one, two, three, longer, and then a sun down below. Cool. Cool. Okay, so let's write it one more time. Let's write it one more time. Okay. Okay, it is e r s Okay, it's longer. Okay, Okay, so let's see what is the usage of tuo. Wrong. I'm wrong. 我错了,我错了, okay. When you want to apologize to others, you may say, 对不起,我错了, I'm sorry, I'm wrong, okay. One plus one is equals to two, not equals to three. I'm wrong, 我错了, 我错了, okay. 错, I'm wrong, 我错了, okay. When you say I'm wrong, we usually have I'm sorry, you know, before to make everything smoothly and more polite. So it should be 对不起,我错了,对不起,我错了. I'm sorry, I'm wrong. Okay, when you say 对不起, it will make you, it will make everything sincere, okay? 对不起,我错了. Sometimes, when, uh, you know, assume me, we all, sometimes we make some minor mistakes. So uh, I'm sorry, 我错了, 对不起,我错了. And I'm welcome and I'm very happy to uh, all of you sometimes can uh, let me know, you know, down below and tell me, still is someone, some part of your video is wrong, do you don't mind to make some adjustment or modification? I don't mind and I'm very happy and I'm very grateful that all you guys can remind me. So don't hesitate to let me know if I do something wrong. Okay, 如果我做错了什么,请别太担心,直接告诉我吧。我非常乐意去接受大家对我的批评还有一些指点当然记得是要友善的 must be kind and be lovely okay be kind and be nice number three 大 big big okay 大 don't you think this sound is little bit sounds like 大 it okay because they share the same 双母 and 韵母, but with different tone. It ah, is the third tone. Da, da, da. This one, da is the fourth tone. So it is da, 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 right? So remember when you were speaking Chinese, don't think, okay, don't think the tone doesn't matter. The tone takes very important roles in Chinese. Different tone, they will have different meanings. So don't mix up the tone. When you are learning Chinese, make sure that you know how to write, you know what is it, you know the shomu, you know the yumu, and also master the correct tone, okay? Da, okay, da. How to write da, super easy, okay? Number one, a line and then a human. Da. Three strokes only, right? So easy. So let's read it one more time. It is one, two, and three. Da. 
Da, okay, da is big. What is the usage? I ate two big apples. 我吃了两个大苹果。我 ，I， 吃了 ，that means eat. But when you see 了 ，that means happened already. 所以是我吃了 ，I ate 两个 ，two. Okay. Don't say 二个 When we are counting like one, two, three, we may say 一二三 But we want to say there are two. Things okay. Two things, two objects. We won't say 二个 We will say 两个两个 Okay. So it is the daily usage, the usage difference from counting. So we have to bear in mind and remember it is 两个 not 一个啊、uh, not 二个 Okay. 个 is the measure word of a lot of objects. Okay. 个大 big 苹果 apples. Okay, so ah,、uh, in Chinese we won't have the plural form, so we will just say 苹果苹果苹果 is the 后鼻音 So remind be beware of your tongue, ah,、uh, your tongue and also your mouth. It should be 苹昂昂苹果 Okay, so let's read the sentence together. 我吃了两个大苹果我吃了两个大苹果。我吃了两个大苹果。I ate two apples. I two ate two apples. Okay, the last two, which is 大学，大学 ，which is university, university. Okay, 大学，学 is learn, learn. 大 is some like a very big um a place, a high level. Okay, ah,、uh, environment for us to study. 大学 Okay, so 小学 is an elementary school, so it is small, small. When you, when you are getting older, when you are more knowledgeable, okay, you can go to study in the middle school. 中学 Okay, 中学 including a middle school and high school. Okay, 大学 that means oh, you are very good. Now you can get into the university to get a degree. Okay, 大学 So how to write 学 It is 一二三 Okay. Remember, it is not like this. Do you still remember the last time we learned this one from the band four or band three? This part is totally different from 学学 is three dot. It is 一 dot and dot. But in this case, it is one and straight line and dot. So it is different, okay. So don't mix them up. Don't mix them up, okay. So 大学 should be. Let's write 学 okay. It is 一二三，然后一个盖子。子，子 means student. Uh, 子 this case, the lower part of this character actually it means son or daughter in Chinese. 子，子 okay. So let's write. Ah,、uh, 学生 Okay, one more time. Okay, it is 一二三四五六七八 So let's write 大学 together. It is 一二三一二三四五五六七八大学大学 What is the usage of 大学 Do you know that? Let's check it out. I'm studying at Peking University. I'm studying at Peking University. Okay, 我在北京大学读书。北京 Okay, is Beijing one of the famous university in China? Is Peking University? Okay, 我在北京大学读书。I'm studying at Peking University. If you want to say, "I'm studying at Hong Kong University," you may say, 我在香港大学读书 Okay. If you want to say, "Wow, you know, I'm graduated from the Harvard University," you may say, 我曾在哈佛大学读书 So you may say, 大学 is university, right? 
So speaking of, okay, going back to our sentence, okay. So let's read more, okay, read more. It should be 我在北京大学读书. 我在北京大学读书. 你们呢? 你们在哪所大学读书? I'm very curious. So don't hesitate to let me know and write down your university's name in Chinese down below and share with Sumi. Okay. 我在北京大学读书, 我在香港大学读书, 你在哪间大学读书, 你在哪所大学读书? Okay, 你可以告诉我, Last one, 大学生, 生, that means a uh, person, the person who study in the university. So it is university student, right? So let's write 生, okay, the new character. It is one, 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 okay. <laughs> okay, actually it should be, remember, even though it looks like three, but it doesn't write in this. If you write in this order, it is not correct. It is not correct. You have to write the cow first. Cow? Where is the cow? I will show you. In Chinese, one, two, three, four. It is cow, ox, mm. it is the cow, the buffalo. Give them a land. It is sheng, sheng, okay. So remember the order, okay. Don't write the three in Chinese first, okay. You should write the cow first. So let's write sheng one more time. It should be one, two, three, four, five. Well done. So let's write 大学生 together. It is one, two, three. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now one, two, three, four, five. 大学生, 大学生, a university student. Okay, the usage is the university student. I am and university student. 我是一个大学生. 我是一个大学生. And to be really honest, in Chinese, we seldom say I am 一个. When you say 一个, it is like a English Chinese, okay? It is not local, Um, it is not authentic Chinese. We will say 我是大学生 is enough. 我是大学生 is enough, okay? 我是大学生 is enough. So we don't need to say 一个. 我是大学生, I am an university student. So it is quite a little bit different from English because in English, I would say I am an university student, right? But in Chinese, if it's only one, we won't say 一个, we will say 我是大学生, okay? 我是大学生, okay? So today we have learned five phrases from Ci to the okay so let's read this vocabulary first okay to do a, a little summary okay the first one is 从, 从, which is from from 从, 我刚从图书馆过来, i just came here from the library okay 从, number two 错, i'm wrong 错, wrong number three 大, 大, which is big, big. Number four, 大学, 大学, university, university. Number five, 大学生, 大学生, which is university student, university student. Okay, so let's read the vocabulary list from episode nine together. We will read each phrase two times, okay? So, are you ready? Yes, right? So, let's go. 从, 从, 错, 错, 大, 大, 大学, 大学, 大学生, 大学生, marvelous! We almost finished all the vocabulary list today. So, in the end of the lesson, what we have the traditional is 
to do the daily quiz, okay? The quiz of the every lesson. So the, le the quiz of today is, what is the difference between 大学生 and 大学? What is the difference between 大学生 and 大学? So don't hesitate to write down your answer below, and I am very happy to check out the answer with you guys. Today, we have learned a lot of vocabulary from new HSK Band 1, and I do hope that all of you can enjoy and benefit from watching my videos. If you do think so, don't hesitate to like my videos and subscribe my channel, and also share my videos to your friends who are interested in learning Chinese. Moreover, don't hesitate to follow my Instagram, Sumi Learns Chinese. So see you guys next time. Bye.